I am the famous American and I have an idea, a concept to share with you and you can determine whether you can agree with this because I think I'm onto something here. Traditionally, it's been said here in the United States when we identify what is perceived as racism, we say you, you shouldn't judge a person on the basis of, of their skin. And we say that, judging them on their skin color. The thing is, I don't agree with that. I don't think it's simply skin color. I think it's an idea of how we perceive that person's race. And of all people, I know, I get it. Race is a social construct. We created that. We created the whole one drop rule thing. And now it work, can work both ways. I'm aware of all those things. But what I would propose to you, let's say here in the United States, let's say years ago even, back specifically when black people did not have equal rights, much more so. And let's say someone was albino, but they were African American. So their skin color may have even been lighter than mine, but let's say in theory that their other physical traits of African heritage did not quite show through. And technically they look like someone who could fit in with everybody else as far as of European descent, okay? So it's not their skin color. Because again, they could be lighter than me. But let's say it's a man who kept his hair short and appeared to be white. And he could get away with having rights that white men would have as perceived to a black man. So I think in that scenario that he would not be judged on his skin color as long as they were not aware of the actual African heritage and DNA. Now, if that did show if those physical traits did show through other signs of it got out then that could be a different story and even in that case this is my point he would be judged on his race identity and not his skin color i don't think it's skin color i think it is an identity that goes with a race it's the it's ultimately a cultural identity can you agree with me your thoughts and opinions belong right here